Hi, it's Terry here, D-Lab. In this video, I'm going to show you an inexpensive solution for changing the filter caps in your DX60 by using these universal capacitor kits available from SledSeats.com. Alright, we're going to start a recapping process on the DX60B transmitter. I'm going to start with the CAN type filter capacitor here mounted on top of the chassis. So this is a dual 40 microfarad at 450 volt cap. And then there's two other caps underneath that work with this capacitor to filter the high voltage of the transmitter. Now you can buy these filter capacitors, but what I'm going to do instead of replacing it with one of these CAN type, so I'm going to install one of these dual capacitor assemblies. There's a fellow ham, his name's Scott, he sells these four in one boards. His website is sledseats.com. I'm only using two of the filter caps to replace this capacitor and the other two will be radio mount underneath. This is a really slick way to change these filter caps at quite a cost save. So if you take a look here close at the bottom of this filter cap you're going to see two screws. There's actually a flange underneath the chassis. I'll show you that in a minute. But that flange meets right up with the pattern of these universal capacitor replacements. So changing this should be a breeze. Now here's the bottom side of that filter capacitor I was just showing you. And there are the other two 40 microfarad caps that work in series with that to handle the high voltage of the transmitter. So I'm going to get this all dug out and get the new cap in place and we'll get it wired up. After we're completed with that, there are a couple more capacitors here and up there that need to be replaced. We'll get to those later. Well, one thing I need to mention, if you're going to replace these filter capacitors in your DX60 transmitter, remember these caps are working in series to handle the high voltage that's applied. So make sure to use the same brand and rating of caps for all four of these. I buy these through Mauser Electronics. They're a very high quality capacitor. I've had great luck with them. Okay, installation is complete. This is the top side of the two capacitors on the universal mount. Let's go underneath and see what that looks like. All right, there's the bottom side of the universal cap. You can see the turrets for mounting resistors and leads. These two capacitors also work in series with the top side capacitor assembly to handle the high voltage. I have two standalone radials here in this power supply section and then up behind the function switch is one more radio and that's all that's required for capping the DX60 transmitter. This radio also has the D-Lab push to talk module installed but that's covered in another video. Alright that's all there is to it. A very clean and inexpensive solution for changing the filter caps in your DX60 transmitter. I understand that Scott sells these kits on eBay. Check it out, buy some kits, save some money.